Today I went to Hamburg, which is in Lexington, and I went to the dress barn, and I bought this dress for $40. I'll hang it up so you can see it. But I love it. It's very slimming. Um, this looks, right here it looks like it would be low cut, but it's not. It is the perfect um, cover. And then, for the big part of this video, I went to Ulta. Since I bought so much stuff, they gave me two free samples. You know you've spent a lot of money when they give you free things. So this is the Better Than Sex Too Faced Mascara. And I also got a sample of the Cargo Better Than Waterproof Mascara. It's just, it's just a small trial size. The next thing I got was Too Faced Better Than False Lashes, and I've heard great things about this. Um, I'll open it. There we go. And this is what it looks like. So the way it works is you put on the black mascara first on your eyelashes, then you add the white, and then you do another coat of the black. So I'll probably do a review on this um, so you can see it. I forgot to say prices. The samples were obviously free. The Better Than False, the Better Than False Lashes was $35. The next thing I got was this Cargo Cosmetics Let's Meet in Paris eye palette. And this is fairly new. It was about $36. like fabric so I'm sure that's gonna get dirty and disgusting which kind of makes me sad but that's okay because it wasn't that expensive for what you get you get 12 eyelash eyeshadows eyelashes you get 12 eyelashes in this you get 12 eyeshadows it has a full mirror and they're very holiday themed like you can see the sparkly green and um, the highlight it looks like all of them have a fairly, these have a glittery finish, it looks like. Um, this one, these all look like satin finishes. This one actually looks kind of matte. And it comes with a nice brush. It has a nice angle on this side, if you can see that. And a nice um, fluffy part on this side. So I'm very excited to try these out. Stay posted for um, tutorial. To tour, <laughs> I can't talk for how to videos because I'm sure I'll make them after I experiment for a while. Um, the next thing I got was I went up to this lady who was not that friendly and I said, <laughs> I need the perfect shade of red lipstick for my skin tone and my hair because I get really pale in the winter. So she gave me this Smashbox infrared matte lipstick. And I'll open it up. It's kind of small. It was $20, and for $20, it's pretty small. It's only that big. So, I guess I'll see if it's worth the value. It's a beautiful red. That's what it looks like on my hand. I'm very, 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 very excited to use it. And then I bought... The Urban Decay Revolution Lipstick. This is the shade F-Bomb. How classy. <laughs> it's also red. It's a little bit brighter. It's more of a fire engine red. And it's a good size. Um, as always, Urban Decay has very nice packaging. So you can see that it's more of a fire engine. Um, the Smashbox is on this side and the Urban Decay is here. I think I like the Urban Decay better, but we'll see. It looks a little bit richer. Okay, now for the big kahuna. For $60, the Urban Decay Vice 2 palette. Oh, Angel Bells. Okay, so they are 20 brand new shades, which means that if, you're, if you have the Naked palette and the Naked 2 palette, you'll notice that they copied half-baked, they're in both of them. So that just means that these shades are unique to this palette and it's limited edition. So run out and get it now before it's gone. Because I missed out on the first Vice palette. 
And that's just upsetting. Um, it has this padded part at the front to make sure that the UD emblem is protected. It's a nice plastic, so it would probably crack if you dropped it, but we're going to treat this as if it's a baby to be cherished. It has the nice, um, it kind of, it's a plastically, I cannot talk, plasticky crystal UD emblem, and it says Vice 2, and it's a pretty purple, and you press this button, and it magically opens. And so you can see all of the pretty shades. Just look at them. They all look pretty satin finished, except that, that looks glittery, these two do. I'm so excited. Some of these, I'm not really sure how I'm going to wear them. I'm not really a bright pink kind of girl. That's not really for me. I'll probably like the blues and the purples. I'm very, very, very excited. So for $60, this was definitely a buy, especially since it's limited edition. And they also give you this lovely brush. And on one side, it's a compact, kind of a contouring brush. And on this side, it's more of a fluffy blender brush. It reminds me of the one they give you on the Naked 2 palette. Except with the Naked 2 palette, it's a very um, pointed precision brush. And this side is a little bit fluffier and larger on the Naked 2 palette. Overall, I'm very, very, very happy with my purchases. And I can't wait to use them.